Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maya, if you're new. And today I'm going to be doing a video of my top 10 completed pages of 2023. So I love watching these kind of videos and think it's a lot of fun to look back at your pages. And um, I did this last year too. I, it, it was a lot of fun. So anyway, let's get started. The first one is Night Voyage and by Daria Song. And um, it's this page here. Um, this was a buddy color with my friend Doodle Roba. And um, yeah, I love how it came out. Oh, let me just put a little more light here. Um, I love the blue-violet background. It's the darts going to a dartboard, and she's like riding one of the darts with her cat. <laughs> so um, yeah, I love how that one came out. It was a lot of fun. It's always the double page spreads that are my favorite. Um, so that's a night voyage. The next one is Joanna Basford, and this is the only one that's not a double, or I think I have two that are not double page spreads. And um, even though I did complete both sides, this one is, I believe, last year, and the one I'm referring to is this one. This is one of my favorites of the year, the underwater scene, and I love how it came out. The, the uh, ocean is done with pencil. And also the sky, but I did use a lot of acrylic marker and I think it kind of pops against the pencil work. So, um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I just really like how this one came out. One of my favorites. And I also love this one from last year. So, um, That's in Worlds of Wonder by Joanna Basford. The next two pages are from Romantic Country, The Second Tale by Eerie who I love, definitely one of my favorite artists. And um, I have the mermaid page from the summer. And that one is definitely one of my favorites. Love how this one came out. Just, uh, yeah, again, the double page spreads. You just put more time into them, you know? And the other one is the ballroom page, which I also love. And then there's the sky again. Um, I did a lot of the dresses with Prima watercolor and pencil on top. The curtains are Prismacolor. I have graphite tint in here. So a little bit of everything, as is with all my pages. But yeah, Eerie is just so fun to color. It's very inviting, her books. And I love, like, scenes. So <clears throat> love those two from Eerie. The next two are from Journey to Wonderland. And I have my succulents page, first of all. Love that one. This was so much fun to color. I love coloring greenery, and um, it was just calling to me. Just love that page. So that is the succulents page. The background is watercolor. And a lot of these are Neocolor 2 and Ink Tints. The next page is the Mushrooms in the Forest page. I think this is one of my favorites of the year. So, um, yeah, I love how that one came out with the grass here. And uh, I love forest like themes with mushrooms. And it's one of my favorite like, themes. So I love how this one came out. It was, it was a lot of fun to do it. A very enjoyable page. Um, and uh, the next two are one of my favorite artists, for sure, Thomas Tomic, who is absolutely amazing. And um, I think uh, his books are my most treasured books. So the first one is The Castle. And um, this one was a more recent completed page. I love how it came out. And... Um, they do take a while, but they're so satisfying when you're done, you know, just love looking at it. <laughs> so it was, it was a lot of fun. And I did base a little bit with uh, water-based markers and I did pencil and ink tents on top. So there's a lot of ink tents in there. Then I have this double page spread, which is the princess and the, the knight on the horse. And I love how that one came out as well. Um, 
so much beautiful detail in the illustration. I did use quite a bit of metallic watercolor there, so you could see. And um, yeah, so that's definitely another favorite. Thomas Love Tomic. The next one is in Wonderland, a coloring book inspired by Alice's Adventures by Emily Shen. And um, this is another beautiful book. I do have a whip in here, but I did this page this year, double page spread, and it's definitely one of my favorites. A lot of the double pagers are my favorites because you put the most effort in them and, you know, I like like a scene. I just love that, you know, sorry that my, my camera is a little bit crooked. There we go. Just fixing my camera there. Sorry. <clears throat> and so that is definitely one of my favorite uh, spreads this year. And the last one is probably my favorite. I don't know. It's hard to pick a favorite, but. I think this is what this one is my favorite, and it is this one, <clears throat> the uh, Alice dancing on the mushrooms. This is definitely one of my masterpieces. I love how it came out, and um, it's just so cute. I did really do a lot of pencil work here, and I probably would do it differently uh, this time around. I would use more watercolor, but um, my wrist hurt so much after I did this because I did a lot of pencil work here but it was worth it it was really nice I love how it came out so that is in Alice's Little Wonderlands by Francesca Rossi <clears throat> so um, that is 10 but I do have some honorable mentions that are also favorites it's hard to pick 10 so I kind of pick like 14 or so so the next one is, you guys saw this recently, is my, my page in the other Thomas Atomic uh, book, The Fairy Sleeping Among the Mushrooms. I love mushrooms, as you can see. So that's another favorite for sure. Then I have um, Gulliver's New Travels by James Gulliver Hancock. And of course I have a whip in here as well, but this is my double page spread that I love. Also, it was a lot of, this was so much fun working on. It was so enjoyable. And um, every time I took it out, I would do like two plants, you know, I would do just a couple of things and put it back on the shelf and then come back to it. So it was a lot of fun. So that's my Gulliver's New Travels page. I want to go back to this book really soon. Um, the next one is also a favorite of this year in uh, Yururi Mouse, Field Mouse sketchbook. Uh, where is it? <clears throat> and it's this one. I based it with uh, watercolor and then I did polychromos on top and I love the result. I don't know why I just love this page so much. So this is another favorite of mine personally. Um, there we go. So cute. This paper is wonderful in this book. Um, another wonderful paper book is Eerie. And, um, and here I have, I really like how this double page, uh, again, double pagers end up being favorites because you put, they're just more impressive. I don't know. So I do love how this one came out too. It's an honorable mention for sure. And that's the girls swimming in the ocean. You guys saw that recently. And yeah, um, this year was a lot. I know a lot of people like this one, <laughs> the hummingbirds. Um, this year was a really good year. I, I had a lot of fun coloring this year and my channel grew a lot this year. I thank you so much for all your support, your wonderful comments. And it's very enjoyable for me to make videos and um, chat with you guys as well and share with you my coloring journey. So thank you so much for following along this year. I look forward to another wonderful year of coloring. I wish you guys uh, good health, lots of coloring and enjoyment in this wonderful hobby. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, everyone.